So I was just sitting here and all of a sudden this little boy came through here and he had a striped shirt on and he just walked and I guess I was frozen, I don't know, but I went looking for him and then there was no, um, there was no cars in the parking lot, no one in the building. I just went, okay. So that night when I went to the wake and I was looking at the picture board, he was in the picture board. This is, pro no one really stays in this room. We really don't sell a lot out of this room. Really? Yeah. And I had mentioned that to Cindy and your mother and said they mm. felt the same thing. I says, why is this room, it's not negative, it's still happy, but you just, you just, people. Well, like bleak, kind of? Yeah. And just I like mean, forgot about? Like, maybe. Maybe it's forgot about. I don't know. Do you yeah. feel it? You yeah, felt I it? did. Yeah, I felt it. But then my legs kind of were like, and I'm like, okay, let's go over here. <laughs> wow. Well, is it is it suggestive though? I'm gonna be the no. naysayer, you know. No, it's right I know. No. And that is really the whole thing with these guys, like that I've learned just investigating with them. It is to debunk it, and to yeah. a certain degree. But if you can't explain it, it it's yeah. Just so I see my dad. But if I look saying. at it this way, I see a man with a hat with, see that right there with longer hair? Oh, but he's smiling. Oh my God, that yeah. looks like his father, my father's father. <sighs> Yo. What's going on guys? Welcome back to another little ghost adventure with Grit Paranormal. Today we are at a place that no one has ever investigated before. Today we are at the Purple Rose Home with our two hosts. Thank you so much for letting us come here. If you guys want to say your names and introduce yourself to the i um, Vicki. I'm Kim. It's my daughter. It's my mother. <laughs> but like I said guys, nobody has ever investigated here before. So it's an honor to be here. Thank you so much for letting us come You're here. Welcome. You're welcome. If you guys don't know, go to Instagram. Go follow the Purple Rose Home. We sell all this like old cool stuff you can add into your house. So Antique. Antique, yes. Antique items. I'm sorry. No. But we are very looking forward to come here and investigate. We're about to go on the tour. We just got here. So I found this store like three years ago. I was redoing some rooms in my house and came over and I met Vic and Kim and just immediately fell in love with this place. So Cindy, you all know Cindy, she and I met over here. She lives kind of close and she met a, we met over here one day just to do some shopping and Vic asked, you know, how we met. And so we started talking about ghosts and ghost hunting and all that. And um, sure enough, she said, oh my gosh, can you guys come and investigate here? So again, Thank you. Oh, yes. Yes. Thank you guys. Yeah, and hopefully we can. Honor. Hopefully we can let you guys know what you're feeling and give you some clarity on that. Some Great. validation. I look forward to it. Thank, Thank you. you. No Thank you. Yeah. Anybody else want to add anything? Let's get some ghosts. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. This is where they come. This is where they. This is this. I, I can't put. It's so hard, guys. I know there's so many times we get comments that it's like, you know, that's fake, whatever. We cannot bring across to you what we are feeling. Um, and so much of this is what we feel. I'm just saying, I feel that there's a lot, whatever, it. this is this is its home kind of thing. This is the passageway. She literally has like tears in her eyes. Yeah. Like, I know none of you guys can see this right now, but I wish you could. But I mean, my heart is, my heart is absolutely pounding right now, but there is a passageway here. I mean, I, I'm shaking. I think they're busy at night when you're when 
after you close. Oh, definitely. Oh, oh, they are. I know that because I, I, when I come in the morning, I can always tell if not everything's. I, I think be, be, when I first started, though, this was like more of like a junk, you know, junk store, right. antiques, or whatever. Just that just beeped. Just went Rempod just beeped. Getting that rum pod for us again, please. It's temperature oh, yeah. settings. Yeah, it's the temperature. So, yeah, hit it. It's hitting it. It's touching yeah, it's it. Definitely going. Let's get done. We're just coming over here to document this. No. And it goes you away. Have said that. You shouldn't have and said that. And it goes away. You shouldn't have said that. That's why I was going to say it and then I stopped. So, we know you're sharing your energy with us. And you might not want us focused on that room. If you do not want us focused on that room right now, can you please make that REM pod go off? God, okay. We won't bring the camera in there right now. It's every single time. It goes on command. It happens to us all the time. It goes on command. Do you command. mind turning that off really fast, please? Thank you. Do you want to use this for yes or no questions? If you turn the re if you make the REM pod beep, then we'll, so can you show me your yes, please? So do you want that to beep for yes? Are you still with us? No. Interesting. So like I said, with that. You yeah. have to physically be near that to touch it. Yeah. It don't go off. It doesn't just way. go off. I'm gonna come over here. Can I come in and talk to you? I do not have a camera. I do not have any devices. I have a cell phone in my pocket. I'm going to take it out. Thank it you. It just beeped. Yep. Can I come see you? You know who I am. I'm here all the time. So I will just stand right here. I don't want to be intrusive. We would really like to communicate with you. And if you could just make the room pod, room pod go on. Thank you. That's temperature. Can you make that green light go off for me, please? Any of the so lights. It sounds, it sounds like they're coming back. So. Well, thank so you very much. Thank right you for coming okay? back. Thank you. If that's okay, I'm just going to sit down right here. Thank you. So basically, what's so happening can you right show now me is if I ask you they a don't question. want us to film it. If they I don't want us to go yes in there with no the camera. Question. They want us to just stay the here. Yes. And they're just still trying to acclimate to the whole thing, you, you know? Cool, right? Very cool. <laughs> As a group, should we stay in this room? Green. Yep. Yes. Yep. Stay here. Stay here. Temperature. So we will take green as yes. Sometimes they won't be able to really push it to for, or past that green. So that's why if it's a long period after a question, usually take it as a no. And the green, we just go with a solid yes. Yeah. Do you think it would be okay if we filmed your, your answers, if we put it on camera? It did just be it now. Okay, we're coming. It didn't? It did. It, it did, did beat. Beat. Okay. If okay. at any time, if at any time you want us out of that room, Please make that flash different colors and we will take the camera away. Yeah, we will. You call the shots here, okay? Is it okay that the camera is here? Yeah. Yeah. Are you Thank a female? You. Are you a male? I thought I just heard something back I, there. I heard something back here. Yeah, I heard something back there. Sound like it's like the floor cracking. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Are you a child? Would you like to speak with us using some of our other equipment? Is it okay if I put a recorder right here? Mm -hmm. Let us know if you're still with us. We know this is new to you, and we're sorry if you feel uncomfortable, but like we said before, downstairs, we're not here to hurt you. We're not here to be harm. We're here to learn and hear your story. Coming back. Coming back. Coming right back. Coming back. 
sometimes you do have to show your intentions again to them. That's one thing we always do. Thank you for coming back. Are you nervous with us right now? Hmm? Yes. Yep. Yeah, yeah, you're nervous. Well, I want to let you know okay. you don't have to be nervous. We'll back off. We'll, we'll go into the other room again if you want us to. I tell you what, we're going to leave you alone in this room. We're going to move the REM pod to the other room. If you're not already there, you're welcome to join us over there. We just don't want to intrude in your space. And so we want to gain your trust, okay? We mean no harm, so we want to, we're going to just give you a little space, okay? So we're just going to move to the other room. It's moving to the other room. That's kind of like it's saying, okay. It's like, all right. It's in the car. I didn't take it out of the car. Who has the car keys? I have to carry my purse down on the camera. I would love to go get the K2 and just do a sweep in that room. Okay. Do you like this bed? You like this bed. They do like the bed. I asked them if they like it, it said yes. I don't think that is what's here though. No, I don't think so either. 10%. It is going green as well. No, so that means they're activated. Something something's pressing on. Something's on the bed. And that's why I said I could feel that somebody was sitting on the bed. So I I sensed that you weren't happy. In here when the curtains left neither was I maybe that's what they felt like I wasn't happy when the lady came in and I wasn't here and took all the curtains off my window and I'm like oh, I didn't say it they was okay are, they play a lot off you and you play a lot off them yep mm -hmm. yeah are, are you answering some of the questions in here that Troy Tyler and I are asking two times click twice thank you I will always leave curtains on for you. I'm getting really emotional right now. Yeah. I mean, I, I just... I do, too. <laughs> I'm so sorry I, I let her take the curtains. I won't let that happen again. I feel like... I'm going to go downstairs I can't help keep them up here. Yeah. I feel like it's to be separated from her. I room. just feel like the yeah, way this world is... Keep them up here for a few minutes because... <laughs> Vicky's energy is really strong. Um, it's sucking a lot. And we're going to try to do downstairs and see if we get anything else. But I'll keep them up here for a minute. Yeah. It was one thing that I've been picking up on, and it's weird, and I don't know why. Yeah, if you want to. I'll switch over. Now, I was telling this to Troy and Cindy, too. But and it's, it's nothing on you. It's just it's what's happening. It's whenever I'm near you, I'm getting drained. Really? My stomach's hurt. I've had to come downstairs to get air or use the bathroom both times. And it was when we were upstairs talking, and I was like, do you have a bathroom and stuff like that? And then when we were up in that room, we go over to the other room, and like, I gotta go again. It's, I, I think right now, and I don't know what it could be, but. Yeah, the red just pot's going, off. Red like pot's going off like crazy going off right like now. crazy. I'm, yep. Yo, what the but, hell? Um, <laughs> I don't know what it could be, but when you're in here, and I don't know if it's anywhere else, but it's just like you're you're taking in so much energy. And you do feel drained when you go home. Mm -hmm. More than ever, more. You know that that's funny that you say that because it, I I never did when I used to when I used to leave here when I first um, moved got here and I could I would go home and I would all of a sudden. At six or seven o'clock, I'm like, I'm going back to the store. And mm -hmm. I used to come here and stay till eight, nine, ten. But just lately, over the last three or four years, I, when I go home, I, my husband goes, I'm on the couch. Or I have to take a nap. And I've never taken naps before. Yeah. So I go home and take a nap. Yesterday when I left here, I was like, I mean, we had a great day. It hasn't been that busy. But as soon as I get home, my husband goes, supper's ready. And I go, i got to lay down for ten minutes. This place feeds you. Yeah. Yeah. It was. So I, this I, place feeds yeah. you. Yeah. You know, and right when we walked in, that I was getting that the entire time. And is that's that what Tyler keeps disappearing? I, yeah, I have like, to because I wonder where you're going. Yeah. <laughs> well, it just I, I have.
have to. Yeah, and I don't know why. It, so I'm but, draining you. Huh? I'm draining well, you. Yeah, I'm getting... I'm taking your energy. Because I feel like I have extra energy when I was up in that room and you were sitting on the stairs. Yeah. You yeah. might be. I must have, because I kept looking at you, yeah. and I felt like my shoulders, like, I just felt like all, I, I felt like all this energy, like, it, when you were speaking, they, I felt like they were, they were telling me, I'm not ready, just give me some time, I'm very hesitant, and that's when Reed said all that, and I was like, okay. It's like, you are so interwoven. It, like everything it. is interwoven here with you. Yeah. And you, they are dependent upon you, yeah. and you are dependent <coughs> upon them. If you're so wiped out when you get home, you need to learn to tell them that they need to stay where they are, leave me with energy, I'm not take, I need to go home with enough energy, and really try to focus on that when you Set leave. Set the intention. Set that intention that, I'm, you can't I, take all my energy. And that's energy. hard for me, because I'm a giver. And, I'm not and a they taker. And but they they're takers. That's, they that's the funny but part. They're takers. Because they're takers. In, in, so my, in my takers. way, in my way, it's like I said, it's nothing you can do. It's nothing on you. But it's just, it's taking it all out of me. Do you relate to them almost like you do the living? Yeah. You can't do that. I can't do that? No. It's building way too much of a connection getting, and a bond. It's getting And out. it's giving them way too much power. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Rem Point rem in five. case. <laughs> yep. Rem rem five. That's them saying, like, yeah, basically. Like, what we're saying is kind of... They, in, you have to put the them... You have to put them in a place. It don't mean you don't love them and you don't come in and acknowledge them. They need to be acknowledged. They want to be acknowledged. But when you walk in the door, when you walk out the door, everything has to stay here. Everything, and, and you can't, it's giving them acknowledgement is power. And acknowledgement is power. It feels like a, a lot of more peacefulness in here than before. Um, there was a time, I mean, maybe, well. That's under us. What the? What's what? under us? Dude, this, like this is, this is the, ba the basement's oh, right under us. Someone, dude, someone someone's is punching knocking. right on top. Someone's knocking right here. Yo, what the actual hell? I swear. That's the cellar. Dude, I... Ready? Go, knock on the ground. The REM pod just went. REM pod's going... You can hear it, right? Someone's punching. Someone's, someone's quiet, down quiet, here. Quiet, quiet. I hear voices. We're gonna tap. Yeah, yeah. Oh. My foot was up here. Oh my, God. my foot was no, up I here. I, I someone it, is under God. us. Someone is under us. No, Watch I you. felt that. I, I felt it that. On the ground. It's doing it. Again. It's doing it. Is there like a heat pump? Is there anything? Here. I want you to copy what I'm doing. I hear noises here all the time, but I never. You heard it, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Something is under us, like we need to get the, the. We need to get the portal box right now. Yeah. We need to it. find out what's happening. If anything, you don't think anything's getting upset now, huh? I don't know. You know what? Okay. You know what? We need to regroup, and we, we need, need to. to let's yeah. relax. Just yeah. Did, let's let's regroup. It. It, just it. 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 it just did it twice. It just did. We went to look at the windows and we thought we saw something. We take a look and me and Cindy look right at the same spot. It's almost looking like a face that's in the a, window. That's a man's face. That's yes. a man's face. That's a man's face. And that is standing right there in the window. Looking. That's that same window that I was pointing to from the yard saying that, Dude, you can see that over. so clear on camera as well. Yep. Oh my, yeah. Me and Cindy, I said it right there. I said, that's a man. I felt it was a man earlier. So yeah, there's somebody, right. there's, there's a man. man he's, I don't know if you got that on film earlier. When there's we were somebody outside. in that room that watches over this place. this place. And I asked him, what's in that room? And she said, storage. I said, somebody stays there and watches over. It's like the caregiver, caretaker here 
but whatever is in that room, there is a direct correlation with what is upstairs. It does, it looks like my father. But then when I change this way, I get, then I get somebody different. I mean, if, if, if that's the nose and the mouth and, and you see the two eyes. Yeah, I see the two eyes, but if I look at it this way, I see my dad. But if I look at it this way, I see a man with a hat with, see that right there with longer hair? Like, like a, um, militia man. It, it almost looks like there's someone almost could be in back of him. Right there? Yeah. Yeah, on camera I see, yeah, yeah, that's a fit. I see the two eyes, the nose. Yep, yeah. it's in back. Yeah. Oh, but he's smiling. Oh my God, that yeah. looks like his fa my father's father. <sighs> Yo. Which would mean that's why they're watching over the place to stay with her. But if I look at this, I get but somebody different. But if I look at him this way, I see my dad. And something just I told me we need to go to the front of the house right now. Like, uh, we gotta go look at those windows. I'm like, well, I let's just- Let's do it with the camera. We had to do it, yeah. I gotta find pictures of my dad wow. and my grandfather. Well, I'm I'm astonished. I'm 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 blown away. Let's see what you wanna see what's This on. makes sense now. It all makes sense. How long ago did your father and your grandfather pass? Oh my my grandfather died when I was um maybe eight. And my father died in nineteen ninety seven when I moved here. Oh when you moved here oh, when you moved wait, here. No, no, no. Yes, when I moved here. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Um, October of 1997. When did you buy this? I bought this in May of 1997. They're here. They're here. That's who, that's who, that's who was communicating with us. That's... I think the one reason, I re when I react this way, is when you saw it in the other room. It's I like when there's a relief, anymore. almost. Um, it's like when that puzzle piece fits. Here's for photos? It's when yeah, I feel the, the relief. The reason why they're angry with us trying well, to forget her to make the barriers is because it's her family. Yeah. How did yeah. we not um, think of this? So, and I just want to explain okay, so y'all so don't think I'm a crybaby. Tomorrow is the one year anniversary that I lost my dad. So. And then you know, July, June. I think it was August. I'm supposed so. to be here right now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. It's my dad right there. Let's see. Uh... Wow. Oh my God. It looks exactly like the. Mom, like the photo. look! Look at the photo. Oh. That looks exactly like him. All right, let Who me, said this? I'll show the, you him with my... In the other room, you were like a shirt. The shirt had... The tie, the black the tie. tie. The you tie. mentioned the suit, the white shirt with the, the black pants. With the black she pants mentioned that. The shirt. That's him. I was like, black pants, white okay. shirt, white shirt. The tie. Yes. yes, and you said with a tie, a yeah. black tie. All right, right there. I was going to say like a wedding day or something. Like... <laughs> Okay. All right, so there's, all this look. is connecting the dots to say, go look See, at that picture. My grandfather. On the, all the way on the right? That him. That face. That's the face. Someone look at, told me right at that, moment that, that picture the there and that get, picture get your, there. Get that photo up See and let's compare, compare the two. Yeah. Let's compare the two. Let's see what this looks like See now. See if we can compare it. I see the face right here. That's what I see. I see the face right there, and it's kind of wide, just like your father's in that one photo. That, that, that's what, that's what I'm. Oh seeing. my God! Right there, there's Vic. Yeah. yeah. That's my dad. There's his mouth right there. Oh, oh my God! Now I can see. All right, I don't want to look at that anymore. It's kind of creepy now. Oh, so his name that. was Vic as well. Yeah, he was Vic. Victor, or just Vic? Victor. I'm Vic. All right, so I guys, wanna, do we want to see if this is anything? It is. Does it look we like him to you a little there? Well, Reed has a better look on the camera. Definitely, yeah. Uh, wow. I mean, off of first reactions, you're gonna know more than I am. I, I just feel it. Does it click with you, Vic? Does a it little click? bit. You got this. Well, because he knows I, I see. I when my dad died, I still don't have him dead. I have him living in a nursing home. The bed. That's me. That's the, the bed. Did he that's have this. did he have lung issues? Yep. The bed. 
Yeah. The bed, the curtains. The he bed. was on bed rest. We meant we mean you talked about this bed rest. Was there somebody in here with on bed rest? And somebody in here on bed rest and you still have him in a nursing home. In your mind, he's in that room right now. Mm. I never had him up no. there. I had no, 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 I know, yeah. But, but you said in your mind you still have him in a nursing yeah. home. You have to build that in your mind, whether you don't know where it is. All of that feeling is stored somewhere. Manifesting. And right now, it is stored up in that bedroom. Mm. That's the reason why it's people that, walk it through it that It might room. be crazy, but that's... And like, yeah. we're like, is somebody on bed rest? Is somebody can't get out of bed? Is some, well, it's... And it was okay, answering. so let me... It was answering. So, this is edited, right? Oh, yeah, we can edit. Yeah, you want me to turn it off? All right, so not... not all right, so this... So... Yeah. Rose home? That's a rose home. That's a rose, rose home. Are you talking about the purple rose? Yes. yes. What about Victor? Victor, are you here? Is that you, Dad? Are you there? Uncle. 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 Clear as day. Uncle. 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 You think? Yeah. He's definitely uncle. Billy, do you know you're dead? <laughs> yeah. 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 Can you tell us how old you were when you died, please? Forty-two. Forty-one. I thought I heard forty-one. I, I heard forty-something. It's older than that. If you make it go green, we can say that for yes. Can you make it go green for yes? Okay. No. I can't. So don't be afraid to come in and touch this little REM pod and let us know that you're here. Because someone wants to come forward. Hey everybody. Hey everybody. Hey everybody. Hey everybody. Who is this? You're new. What's your name? Ken. Ken? How many spirits are in this room with us right now? Bill be me. Bill? Bill and me? Bill LeMay. Yeah, yeah that. Bill and me. I heard bulimic. Huh? I heard bulimic too. <laughs> I heard, I heard, I heard Bill, Bill, Bill and me. Bill and me? Bill and me. Who's me? So who's me? Ted. Oh, who's Bill? Uncle Bill. Uncle. Uncle. Really? Is Vic? Is Vic in too? Is that you? Dad. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I can't hear that. Yeah. I'm here. Did it sound like him? Nope. Well, it's, it's not always it's, going to, but... Usually, they will never sound the same. Mm. I still have you with me all the time. Is that why you're here? Of course. Of course, of yeah. Course. Of course. Hey, BB. Hey, hey BB. Easy? Hey, my it baby. It sounded like I said, hey, BB, or no, something like that. my hey. baby. Baby. Oh. <laughs> Love you. You hear that one? You just... Did he call you his baby? Did he nothing? But I was his youngest. Were you the youngest child? Middle. Middle. Are you here to protect me? Of course I am. Of course I am, yeah. Are you why is he in the bed though sick? <laughs> Ask him. Why are you in the, just said ask him. Why are you in the bed here that you're still sick? Are you still sick? Hey, we no. 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 Have you Have you seen mom? Hell yeah. <laughs> That's what I thought Hell I said. Yeah. Oh yeah. Hell yeah. Gather. Gather? That's my mother. Catherine? Elizabeth Catherine. Catherine. Does Catherine need me to stop talking bad about her? Mom. Mom. I won't talk bad about you anymore. No. Will you like that better? Well, absolutely. 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 Okay. 
<laughs> All right. I won't. I won't talk badly about you anymore. That was the clearest wow. I've ever heard of anything. Absolutely. I mean, that's a four-syllable word. That just don't happen. <laughs> <laughs> I'm good. Yeah, I'm oh, good. I'm good. Oh, you're good. Okay, I'm, I'm good. good. I'm glad Hungry? you're good. I know when you were dying, I told you, I wish I'd known more about your sickness like I do now. I still feel that way. Well, that's fine. You're fine? Fine. Yeah. But sometimes I still get very angry about things with you and the way we grew up. And I'm sorry. Me too. We're, We're good. good. We're, We're good. 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 Wanna go out? My love. My love? Oh, was it my love? I thought it said wanna go out. I thought it said I thought I heard knock, knock him out. No, <laughs> I heard wanna go out. I thought I heard my love. Like, like I'm hungry, I wanna go out? Too. Like that's what I just heard. Alright, so we're gonna wrap things up. Thank you so much for letting us come and for communicating. And we look forward to we look forward to coming back. They keep knocking from Thank the other room. Oh, that's the only first time I've heard that. I heard it. That's why I walked over there. I heard a knock over there. Whoa. Well, we had one heck of a night. Mm. And, I mean, I don't know if we can really put it into words. I mean, Vic, you want to let them know how you kind of feel if you can put it into words? Yeah, I feel really happy. <laughs> I feel, um, I'm glad that I did this and um, it was such a wonderful experience. It's something that you just can't explain. You have to really live it to see what happened here tonight. And I thank each and every one of you. Well, we thank you for having us. Thank you. Yeah, I really thank you. It was great. You wanted the validation. I think it's safe to say. Yeah. <laughs> you got the validation. Oh, yeah. well, you got some answers that make oh, sense yeah. to you. And... All, it all makes sense now. Yeah. Yeah. And I think over the time of the night, I mean, oh my the God. way we all came together, yeah. we pieced it by piece. I mean, coming into a spot like this, not knowing anything, this was our very first time. So uh, trying to find what was there at the beginning, I mean, all of us, I think, can agree. We didn't know, you know. Had no idea. We, had, we no didn't know idea. anything. Had no idea. But as the night went on, Everything. Things clicked, and yeah. you guys saw that. I mean, I think all of us are, you know, proud to say that, you know, it's quite an we, experience. we did figure yeah. something out. Mm. Yeah. I, and think we, we, and we something. I think we each learned a little bit more about um, what we're each capable of. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I mean, it's not just learning about the investigation. It's learning about ourselves mm. and us together. We... We put all of those to use tonight because we kind of had to. Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. We're, we're helping somebody here. This is more than just investigating a conjuring house or the USS Salem. This is helping somebody in their life with what they're going through. So this was kind of a new thing to us and what we do with our investigations from what you guys see. But I'm glad we actually took this head on and that we helped you get the answers that you got. Oh, yeah. yeah, I thank you, really. No problem. Yeah, and this is... It makes at, so much sense. At the end of the day, yeah. this and is you know, what we do. <laughs> no, no. I yeah. think we came in... It, it. This feels way different leaving yeah. than yeah. when we came in before. Absolutely. Yeah. This, this feels peaceful, relaxed, mm. and before it did feel good, mm. but this is... It feels even This better. is a, oh, almost better. a brighter feeling. Yeah. Yeah, because yeah. 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 now I feel like... Whoever were here, I was afraid that they'd be mad at me tomorrow, but now I'm feeling the opposite. Like, yeah. it's a whole different, happy. Yeah, and it's my drained. dad. No wonder things happen because that's the type of man he was. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. This yeah. is exciting. This is exciting. I'm excited. Home peacefully. Yeah, and I'm yeah, excited so to see what happens after this too. Yeah. You know? so. That that's one thing too. So we're gonna get updates, guys, and we're gonna let you know in this video on you know how things are looking afterwards. Yeah. So um, it'll be exciting, and you know I I hope that you do share that with us too. So I will definitely see, oh, especially in how that room that we were just in doing the portal box, if that room gets more attention to you know different feelings in the house. Mm. I think we did great, guys. Yeah, yeah. Thank absolutely. You. Thank you. Yeah. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you for having us, really. Thank you for having thank us. Thank you for yeah. And I need to having say thanks to Grit. Yeah. No awesome. problem, Cindy. Thanks to Grit for having me and no um, problem. Yes, and thank sharing you, Cindy. things thank with you, me. Thank you, Cindy. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's always good. <laughs> it's always a fun time with the Grit boys and girl. <laughs> well, Troy, as always, 
Finish her off. One last thing before I do it. Our merch is finally out. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Merch merch is merch is ready. our merch store is Woo. finally up. So if you guys want to go ahead and get your very own Grit Paranormal neck gaiters, your shirts, your hoodies, we even got dad hats. You guys go ahead. We're going to drop the link in the description. You can go ahead and get your own Grit Paranormal merch. Every piece of merch that you buy helps support us so we can keep doing this for you guys. And that's all this really is about, guys. You. So, I'm going to do it one more time for you guys. Peace out, Grit fam. After speaking with Vicky the past few days, she has felt a lighter presence in the house. She's been able to go home and sleep and not be drained the next morning or the night that she comes home. Again, thank you to Vicky and her daughter for letting us come into the house and letting us investigate and validate the spirits that are in the house. Thank you for watching.